What's going on YouTube? Zap here, and I'm back with some more Injustice Gads Among Us. Now today I'm actually going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to address a question that I've actually had uh, quite a few times on my videos, and that is, Zappa, how did you get so good at these fighting games? And for modesty's sake, I'm not really all that great. I'm just able to play at a level where you guys find it entertaining, and you, some of you actually walk away from you know watching a video saying damn I could actually um, uh, apply that to, to my, my my character or my play style you know next time I play so I'm okay but I'm not the best um, but just for the sake of answering the question I'm gonna go ahead and say this it takes me a lot of practice just to get to where I'm at okay I have a lot of a you know a, a gap between me and being really really good okay so I have a lot of practice to do. So yeah, that's my answer. Practice, 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 and uh, a lot of patience as well. Okay, because you're going to you're gonna have some hits and misses when playing these games. Okay, so you just got to be patient and uh, learn from your mistakes. All right. Now, <clears throat> one of the main things that I do when I pick up a fighting game is I try to find out exactly which play style. I know for a fact I want to play in that game. For instance, Injustice. I know I want to play a little bit of the zoning, but I also want to rush down when I feel like I need to. So Raven does that for me. A lot of people don't like that that I rush down with Raven sometimes, but you know it is what it is. That's that's what makes me feel comfortable. Okay. So getting into your comfort zone and finding a play style that works best for you. All right. Next is finding the character that best complements that play style. Okay. Now, if you like playing a rushdown character in Injustice, then I would say go with Batman or Scorpion. Or if you like playing a zoning character, you know, play like Sinestro or uh, maybe even Black Adam or Raven if you want. There's just so many different uh, possibilities for you to choose from, but it's all about picking what makes you feel the most comfortable. Okay? If you feel comfortable, then there's really nothing you can't do with these fighting games and your character. The sky's the limit. There's always room for improvement, but seeing that improvement is probably the most rewarding feeling ever in, in gaming. You know, um, and then once you have that character, you go into training mode, or I go into training mode, and I find out what works, what doesn't, uh, which character is going to be a, a good matchup for me, which character is going to be a bad matchup for me. And what I mean by that is. If I'm playing a character like Raven, right, and Raven, she doesn't really have good, you know, normal attacks. Her wake-up options are pretty, pretty bad as well. And I'm getting rushed down by Batman. Batman is rushing the shit out of me, and I'm having a hard time. Okay, I need to learn how to deal with that. How do I keep Batman off of me? Uh, what are my best options when Batman does, you know, the batarangs? Or what are my best options when? Batman has the traits out. You have to learn these these certain things, okay? And you can only learn them just by practicing, whether it be in training mode against a dummy or uh, you know, playing online against someone who who uses that character. I recommend for everyone, like if you happen to come across someone who beats you uh, several times using a specific character, add that person, invite them to a private match, uh, ask them some questions maybe and see what sort of knowledge you can gain from them that'll help improve your game a little bit okay so definitely spend that time in the lab spend that time in training mode and I guarantee you within due time everything will show in your gameplay uh, for the for the better for the positive okay so uh, really honestly that's all I have you know I'm sorry I couldn't give you guys some some magic remedy for uh, for your gameplay, but that's all I have. Uh, just practice, stick to it. Uh, don't let little losses get to you, because that's the thing about fighting games. Where some people find it to be repetitive, the the thing that you know brings in the most replay value with fighting games is learning new things every day. All right, do new character matchups, new frame frame data with updates. Uh, you know, just just the game is always evolving the more time you put into it I can guarantee you that so with that being said I'll catch you guys in the next uh, injustice video and I'm out of here
Peace.